Drake right. so overrated. <laughs> well, okay, okay. We're not saying all that. <laughs> <laughs> too far, too far. My bad. <laughs> I'm open. I'm open. I'm open. I'm open. open. Welcome to the I'm Open podcast with Sam, Ryan, Andrew, and Joe. Guys, I got, I got something to go over with you. Oh, okay. So I got this email the other day. (laughs) Oh my god, God. that's a normal curve. B Ultimate heard we were tearing the new AUDL jerseys. Uh, so they they sent me this. They said, F- all caps, fuck you. You cannot post that episode unless they are all S tier. We have taken your loved ones hostage. Plug shop.beultimate.com or else. Hashtag drive, hashtag be yourself, hashtag better than ever. Cordially, Mr. B Ultimate. Oh, shit. Oh my wow. God! We're fun. Right? Yeah, we have we have no choice. Go yeah. to shop.beultimate.com or else, or else, or else. <laughs> or else. <laughs> or else. No limit. We've taken our. They've taken our loved ones. <laughs> do you guys have loved ones? <laughs> No, I just I just do this podcast all the time. <laughs> I only I only love shop.blt.com. Maybe they just <laughs> <laughs> that's my loved ones. Oh my god, they took shopblt.com. Oh my god. I oh my god, you better ones, shop blt. I have shop.blt.com. Oh, it's shopblt.com, Joe. Sorry, shop, I just shop, shop, shop. shop.blt.com. Uh, uh, Sam, is it is it HTTP or HTTPS? forward slash um, forward slash they they didn't specify so try both at home <laughs> um and if you're if you're an audio only listener it's be ultimate like the verb be not the animal insect e. <laughs> one e b e not two e's one e shop e. yeah one e b shop <laughs> shop, shop. Just, shop just just spell it out in a rhythmic rhyme sam what? <laughs> How do I rhyme? S H O P dot B E U L T I E dot C O M. Or else. <laughs> or else. We can't leave out the or else. I cannot stress that enough. We have a lot to talk about today. There are 48 new jerseys for our 24 AUDL teams. That's and obviously, we need to put them in order on a list of tiers. So we're gonna what a good that. idea. What a good idea. Um, <laughs> believe it or not, this was not our idea. This comes from. Give me a second. Nice. Is that blocking it? Okay, Brandon, Brandon Addy Bay, of the now of the Montreal Royal, formerly of the Ottawa Outlaws, who called us out to do a tier list, and. Subsequently, mm, got okay. himself <laughs> got himself onto the pod. So we're gonna have him on, and he's gonna help us sort through all of these jerseys. Mm, Any questions? I think from us or from the audience. I think we made it very clear. If you have all any right. questions, let us know in the comments. Let us know in the comments. We'll answer them right now. Yeah. Not seeing any, not seeing any questions. So Great. we're gonna move on. Great. <laughs> didn't uh salt lake get somebody oh they oh. got grant lindsley yeah grant lindsley yeah and you talked to lepler about it yeah me and lepler just talking shop just like old very cool. pals just like the old chums that we are me and lep we go way back i mean let's yeah, be real. you guys do go very very far back he knows that too i've been on his replies for oh. about a year now <laughs> i think he knows who i am <laughs> Hey, hey, what's up? Hey. How's it going? Hey, Brandon, what's up? Uh, living life, can't complain. Is that a I Sprout don't... sponsored jersey? Say that again. Is that a Sprout sponsored jersey in the background? No, it is not, unfortunately. 
Oh, uh, it is Sprouts Farmers Market, so it's pretty nice. That's what I meant. Uh, yeah. Oh, like I'm not sponsored by them, but but like, like that jersey. Cookies. Yeah. Big fan nice. of their cookies. They got they got <laughs> solid. <laughs> not like just all in America, or is it like only West Coast? I don't know. I'm in Denver. And there's the Sprouts. I think Denver. it's only West Coast. I've never. They had them in place in New Mexico. In yeah. We'll call it a West Coast store. Well, Brandon, welcome. Um, thanks for calling us out to get this tier list going. Um, and obviously, there's like so many jerseys, so it's going to take forever. So we're going to give you two minutes to tell us your Frisbee, entire Frisbee history. Only two minutes? Yeah. <laughs> On the clock. <laughs> okay, so I'm pretty new to Frisbee. Started like four years ago. First year, made it on the Ottawa Outlaws, playing semi-pro in Ottawa. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Didn't take you long. <laughs> Damn. Hey, Lou, stop interrupting. You only have sorry, a sorry, sorry. and a half left. <laughs> well, add extra time, like soccer. It's soccer rules. <laughs> yeah, like injury time and all that. So, yeah. <laughs> first year, I, like, I actually played a professional game before I even played on my university slash college A team. So, I was like. <laughs> This is pretty sick. Didn't really wow. know what I was doing. Got the rookie of the year in the Canada division because we weren't allowed to travel down to the States. So mm. good start to my career. And last year, had my second year on the Outlaws. Wasn't as good. We lost more games. I was like playing injured for a bit of it. But it was good times. And now I can say that I'm with the Montreal Royale. So... Oh yeah! Like yesterday, so pretty good time. Awesome! Okay, congratulations. Yeah. Um, um, do you speak French? Ahead, yeah, un peu. C'est pas la meilleure, mais j'ai assez. Okay, none of us <laughs> do. <so. laughs> I, I, I was know. like, Wait. Sam, do you speak French? <laughs> no, there was just one of our one of our first. Uh, the first time I watched a, a Montreal game and the announcer was speaking in French, I was like, what's going on? <laughs> yeah, he's like so charismatic too. He'll be like yeah. saying a bunch of things. And no, I like, loved it. <laughs> right on. Um, are, is there anything you're looking forward to in this upcoming season? You got a new team, like maybe getting some Ottawa guys in there. Like maybe the forces are a little stronger on Montreal. Like how, what are the vibes right now? What are you all excited for? Um, so right now it's like a really different team from last year's Montreal Royale because I don't know if I'm allowed to say, but certain guys aren't coming back and oh. you're going to see who isn't in the next few days. And we have a bunch of new blood. And since Ottawa folded, some of our team went to Toronto and some mm -hmm. went to Montreal. So it's like whenever we play each other, which is going to be three times this year, you're going to be seeing quite a few rivalries building. Mm. Nice. And there's a bunch of new talent in Montreal, Quebec, where no one's ever heard because they haven't played AUDL, and you're going to see um, them. So that's sick. Be exciting. Where, that's exciting. where might some of these unnamed players be going if they're leaving Montreal? Um, if you can I'm not say, sure if, if you can say. I'm not sure if they're taking a year off or if they're going to be joining another AUDL team. I don't think many are joining other teams in the AUDL. I think they just played a bunch of club. Some of them played world or club worlds with the Montreal club team. So it was just a lot on their body. So I think they're taking a year off. Totally makes gotcha. sense. Word. Um, well, should we introduce ourselves and then get into some jerseys? Hell <laughs> Let's yeah. Let's do it. All right. Well, I'm Joe. Uh, I'm open. <laughs> I'm Ryan. And I'm open. I'm Andrew. Uh, I'm open. And um, yeah, I don't know. You you probably you've been like following us on Twitter and stuff. I see you like in our replies all the time. So I feel like you probably get the idea. But um, yeah, we uh, we uh, three of us were college roommates, basically. And then Joe was best friends with Sam. So and basically lived in like our college dorm for a couple yeah. of years. So we're <laughs> we're pretty much pretty much buds. Um, and I'm open. Yeah, nice. Uh, I'm Sam and I'm open. I'm Brandon, and I'm also open. Oh, Hell yeah. Oh, amazing. He's open. Amazing. All right, Brandon well gets it. Let's let's get right into this. Here. Let's tear. All right. All right. This I've got a... Be... Go ahead, Alu. 
I was gonna say this would be interesting. Usually we let our guests um kind of have veto power, have final say. So um it'll be interesting to see kind of where your tastes lie. I don't I don't know, you know, we're we're gonna learn together, but I'm excited to get into this. Okay, so first things first, I need that mechanix tier to be Toronto because we don't mess with them around here. Oh right. easy. easy. Can do. Canada beef. We're burning that bridge. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. I love it. That's a great way to start this pod. Drake, so overrated. <laughs> Whoa, okay, okay. We're not saying all that. <laughs> <laughs> too far, too far. My bad. <laughs> yeah, all but right. I'm going to need both of their jerseys down there because <laughs> just me personally to. got a big rivalry with some of them. Mm-hmm. Like, If you go back and watch some film, there was some pretty close fights, close to fights. Ooh. So. Is that Mark Lloyd on the back? I think so. Yeah. Oh, God. I guess you guys would know from uh, the who is Jimmy Mickle from seeing Mark Lloyd mark up against him sometimes. But (laughs) if he's coming back, that's a big plus for them. Yeah, that's a great reference. (laughs) Yeah, it's weird. Some of these um, have like real people, and some of them are just like, oh, there's like 23. Yeah, 23. Phillips are just like the. Aviators one just says like seven player. <laughs> Sam, you're gonna look so stupid if these are real people. <laughs> player, yeah, you're right. Player seven. Well, well I forgot f- about Benjamin Player. Name. <laughs> Name. Anyway, yeah, that guy's on the come up. Don't even. All right. Don't well, my boy Name. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Toronto obviously bottom tier. Do we want to say anything about their actual jerseys, or we just want to leave it at that? They it seems like they didn't really try that hard. It's just, like unless I'm missing something, but it's just like a black and a white shirt with their logo and like nothing too special, I guess. Yeah, yeah there's like, like a little texture on this one, but that's about it. The white one, like the collar, like I don't know if it's just super noticeable on the on the picture, but it's just kind of weird with the neckline. Mm. That's just me. Yeah, it's like yeah. three different shades of white. <laughs> it's like we got eggshell, we got ivory, and we got some other one. Yeah, I don't know. Like we I'm with you there. Um, at the bottom. It's Toronto tier. It's you know. It is what it is. Yeah. Do you guys want to also increasing. name the other two? Hmm? You want to name the other tiers like? Ah, it's too much work. <laughs> if something, you, if something hey, comes to that, us, anything that yeah. you want, we do for this tier list. <laughs> so, like, is D tier just like mid, or how are we defining like D versus C? It's, that's your call here. Yeah, we'll see how it shakes out. Yeah, I mean, yeah, the easiest way would be to just start sorting them out, and then we'll see, like, yeah, kind of where they stand relative to each other. Yeah, we can um, make adjustments as needed. So, what's next? Yeah. I don't know. I kind of want to just go randomly. Do it. Oh, oh <laughs> man, so random. What luck! I All like these. Yeah. It's tenth year anniversary. They're going back to what they almost like what they had in their first season. So they look pretty nice. Nice blue versus orange color palettes. Opposite. Mm-hmm. Got it. Yeah, I think it's clean. I feel like uh, with the crest that they already had, and like I think all of the crest teams look like soccer logos, but like this jersey also looks like a soccer jersey, and I kind of like that they're going for something. And I feel like with the with the crest and with the jersey, it looks good together. Yeah, I think it's clean. This could be A for me, honestly. I'm okay putting it B for now, and then we can make adjustments. But I might even say A. I don't know. Am I crazy? I don't think you're crazy. Uh, it's definitely right. at least minimum like low A tier. Yeah, I'm I'm cool. fine with that. Let's let's throw it in A. Yeah, let's I have no it. issues with it. Like, wait, do we have the, the whites too? We have to do the darks and the whites for everything. Oh let's yeah. Let's do yeah. each team. Let's yeah. Go team by team. All right, the whites. I like the the Florida I like it going on. I kind of like it too. At first, I, I was like, like I was like eh, on it, but I gave it another second, and I I like it. I'm with it. I see what's going on there with the gradient. Brandon, yeah. what's the what's the reason behind adding the Florida lead to the jersey? So the Quebec like national flag they have four Florida leases on it. So 
I'm guessing because Montreal is a city in Quebec, like the province or territory, kind of like a state, they implemented it in the jersey. And with the blue, it just it just goes well. So yeah, that's kind of hype. I like it. I'm. I think it's up there with A or B. I I was gonna say like some of these other jerseys, especially ones we've already tiered. I think the uh like added texture looks like car print like a car just ran over it and that this one does not look like that so i'm <laughs> high on it yeah i'm high on it too yeah all right it seems like there was a lot of thought put into it and it works so well with the white and blue so definitely a as well yeah yeah i'm cool with that cool love it all yeah right. i love including like the local local kind of symbols and stuff but yeah, without kind of doing it too in your face mm. All right, random, random time. Nope, I did it again. <laughs> oh, Detroit. Okay, my first thought when I saw these with the stripes was like, it's kind of like, like the Detroit players are in prison. Like they don't really want to <laughs> be there. <laughs> so that's that's just my first impression from it. It, it kind of looks like a rugby jersey. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah. It does. I'm gonna be honest. I kind of like it. I don't I hate like, it. I like that their logo doesn't have any black in it. I just feel like there's not mm. much you can do with it, and just like a, a minimal color change just takes it from like really bad to like at least lookable. Um, <laughs> lookable, not oh man. I don't know. I kind of I kind of like lookable tier. <laughs> <laughs> I think I I I think. I don't know. I don't I hate it. I don't, a, hate it. I don't hate it. I think it. it's in the lookable tier. <laughs> I think it's certainly, certainly lookable. You know what? I I like that. I think that it, I think that um that's a that's an apt description there. I don't hate it. Um, it doesn't look super. It doesn't scream frisbee jersey to me. I don't know what like if you ask me like what is a good frisbee jersey or what makes something a frisbee jersey. I couldn't tell you. But um, mm-hmm. it, it does. It looks like another sports jersey, but it looks like decently designed, and I think it's has more thought put into it than some of the other ones. So mm-hmm. I kind of um, almost wish the stripes were more prominent. I, I I don't think so. I think I think the faded stripes are good. Then it would really give like I'm I'm stuck in Detroit <laughs> yeah. <laughs> against my yeah. will. Yeah. You're right. <laughs> yeah. The thing that's tough with stripes is that if you have any type of belly whatsoever, then it's a hard to rock that, like because <laughs> it just expands on your stomach. But you know, speaking from experience, there <laughs> <laughs> maybe a little bit. <laughs> All right, let's get to the dark. Uh, not as good, personally. It looks kind of like a Batman jersey. It looks like a Marvel. I know. I was gonna say that it looks like a, yeah. like, a, like a superhero thing. I need to see this one in action. Like I need to see the whole team wearing this one. But my first instinct is meh. It's got where's like the, where's the, the Tony number Stark on the front? Thing. There is no number on the front. Ooh, is that legal? <laughs> it's not. Well, probably. Cheered. I don't know. I'm looking at these other jerseys. Yeah, like, we're, there were none on on the Royal either. I think. No. Oh, good point. It it looks like a number belongs on it. Yeah, maybe it's on the it's bottom so, left hip or something. So, oh, would be kind of cool. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, I'm like know. D. I'm like D here. Yeah, I'm like Less, definitely worse. It's definitely level. not lookable. Yeah. Less than lookable. Okay. Less than lookable. Let's go D. It's not like offensively bad, but it's not. No, no. It's not lookable. <laughs> that is is that a word? We're not unsure. Oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> all right. Pretty much the same. And we did not like them last year. <laughs> Carolina. Yeah, I'm not too high up on it. I'm not high on it. Are you, wait, I... what are you saying, Brent? Are you saying you are? No, I'm not. It's okay. Like, it looks good because they'll win in it, but like you could definitely do better with the color scheme. And I'm not too sure about the different triangles unless they like symbolize something, but. You know, it it's too like military, you know. Yeah. Um, yeah. Like the bottom. I don't like the me, font. I think the bottom reminds me of uh, Minnesota, and. Oh, I see that now. Yeah. Yeah. Other than that, I, yeah, I do think it looks kind of military. But right. I don't know. I mean, it's what not terrible. We... Is it lookable? 
I think the colors are certainly better than Detroit's D. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think, I think, it's, I, it's like, I think I don't like it as much as Detroit's white. So mm-hmm. bottom it, it, of lookable. Yeah. I think it's probably bottom lookable. Cool with that, okay. Brandon. Yeah. I'm, very, I'm good All with right. that. All right. Let's do that. I feel like it might look better if the, uh, the little like V design was asymmetrical, but like if it was just one side, I don't know. What was what was Kyle's character like, Mister Flyer? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. If it had Mister Flyer, it'd be S tier. Well, that's S tier. <laughs> obviously, if they had listened to us. <laughs> but look at us now, lookable tier. That's the best they can do. Yeah. Um, I think- what do you think about this one? I think it goes next to the other one. It's the same, basically. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think it goes slightly ahead just because the blue rings on, like, the sleeves look better than yeah. the, the I'm red on blue. I'm with you. Yeah. I right agree. smack that in the middle. Lookable. Yeah. yeah. It's I a think very, that's... just definitely the definition of lookable. <laughs> it looks It looks like... I think the, the for me the like lookable it like it looks like a professional team's jersey you know mm-hmm. not mm-hmm. all of them do but yeah. I think that's kind of like uh, to me maybe that's kind of my litmus for like what lookable mm. means that's yeah. a good way to look at it yeah that's a good way to lookable about it all right Ooh. oh in the alley cat the dark Let me fill up. I love this one. <laughs> I, I really this, like it. I think this is the best dark I've we've we've ranked so far. Mm, I think it's I, a little below the Royals dark, just because I think the front is the cleanest. I love it. I love the stripes, but the the cat on the back is. I don't know how I feel about that. I love the cat on the back. <laughs> I love it too. It's like business in the front, party in the back. <laughs> I, mean, okay, I wish you, Sam. I'm, oh. Okay. I, right. do, I do really the like the, uh, the three ring sleeve and like the little Indiana logo on the side. I think that's cool. Brandon, did you ask what their mascot is? Yeah. Did you guys ever pick out a name for that one? <laughs> as far as I know, they have not decided on any names yet. We submitted a few, but I don't, I haven't heard anything. <laughs> we we submitted like two, but in our group chat, we like listed out like 30. But they were all just like way too. Bold. None of them we could. None of them we can make public. <laughs> I think. Do we submit Cat Brock? Cat Brock was yeah. one of them. That That's was solid. one that we could submit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mister anyway, Whiskers. Me and me and Ryan love it. What is? Where's everyone else with it? <laughs> all right. You know what? I'm sold. Part right in the back. I'm sold. I think that the cat is amazing. <laughs> I just. I don't know the way that it's just like so big is like yeah. something yeah. that no other team does and i i just think it's great i, I, I just like I, I can imagine like cam making a really nice cut deep and his defender just staring at that cat and just like terrified <laughs> yeah, i think it's an a for me like the black and green when when it's done right Black and like dark green just goes well together. Oh, yeah, yeah. And the cats. I think they did a good job of that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I agree. I like their colors. All right, now um, we gotta decide relative top, to the royal. Yeah, top or bottom? Uh, are we going top? top I mean, top, top, top. I don't I know. Gonna well, well, top. I was, I was gonna Brandon, put Ryan our top. Brandon, yeah, what is what does Brandon <laughs> say? Step in. We'll put them final vote right in the middle. All right. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. fair. I can live totally with that. Deal. Now the white, not as clean. I that's that's my first thought. Like I still like it. Yeah. But I don't the like cat the, on the yeah. back of the of the black is just so much better. If it said Indianapolis and the font was a little smaller and it looked maybe mm-hmm. more like the dark, I'm I'm totally there. But yeah, it's it's a little too like big and round and in the middle agreed i don't really like yeah. the indie of it all yeah, yeah. It's all i loopy. feel like a lot of these whites are just lookable <laughs> yeah. yeah i think like the jerseys are too similar that the logo change between alley cats and indie is like a little bit jarring yeah yeah but i still do think it's like pretty clean in general i'm cool with b 
I'm cool with top of lookable or B. Yeah, I'm good. With Brandon, that. what say you? I'm I'm thinking it's a B. Like it's still a yeah. clean jersey. Yeah, but if the font was different, yeah, or if just like filled out a bit more because there's just like a bunch of white space on the front. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I feel like yeah, the front looks like those uh, NBA Christmas Day jerseys they had like eight years ago. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right. I'm with it. Um... <laughs> Ooh, All right. <laughs> it's time. Yeah, time to get hear. into it. We've got <laughs> Pittsburgh. <laughs> Speaking of tire tread. <laughs> Yeah, so it's what the like hell? mustard yellow <laughs> that's been ripped up to reveal tire tread. <laughs> <laughs> Can we make a tier below Toronto tier? <laughs> Just yeah. have a Pittsburgh tier. <laughs> <laughs> kind of reminiscent of their record recently, so. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is just yeah. not. We're, yeah, we're not a fan of their branding across the board here i think and they really just doubled down in a bad way <laughs> it's kind of yeah. sucks because like all pittsburgh sports teams like it's black and yellow like mm-hmm. the steelers penguins and they know how to do it well but mm-hmm. like mustard yellow on like the tire tracks no, yeah it's just, like, like... there's no there's no excuse for like because, like, all those other teams use the same color scheme, and it looks really good. Like, all the Pittsburgh teams have cool, like, the Pirates jerseys. Yeah. Like, it's, like, it's they're all, like, really clean. And then, like, come on. Like, you have a template there. Mm-hmm. And I will say, I don't think it's tire treads. I think it's, like, steel. I think it is. I think it is. I just think it looks like tire tread. But I do think it actually is. It doesn't, cool. it doesn't make it any better. Yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> but maybe we'd, I'd point that out. But, yeah. Yeah, no. yeah, yeah. It's just too solid. And it's, like... Mm-hmm. Oh, it, it's yellow, like the... yellow is an accent color. That's, yeah, yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking too. We can't look at this one too long. Let's move on to the yeah, Let's get out of here. All right, these are nice. I like them. Much I like better. them a lot more. A lot more. I like that the logo. Con- I was gonna contrast. say, why don't they wait. use this logo way more? Yeah, it's wait, so much what? better. Their <laughs> other logo is dog shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this looks good. good. Yeah, Wait, yeah. How how can they just have a whole nother logo? I don't know. It's baffling. <laughs> I, why are they keeping it a secret? <laughs> it's so much better. This one yeah. is like lookable, like borderline B. Yeah, I think this it's is better B. than lookable. I think it's better than lookable. I I think so too. One thing that's keeping me from putting it in B is like the font of the twelve. I want to know what that font mm. is because it looks like. Like I don't want to say like font. Time. Yeah, it's like not Times New Roman, but it's like not the Ariel. best. Yeah, <laughs> real font. Like, um, that's what that's the one thing that's keeping me out of moving it up, out of lookable. It's definitely lookable, at least though. I think it's higher, personally. Oh, okay. Brandon, what do you think? It's got to be. Ooh, it's actually borderline. Hey, it's close. I like it. I like that. Give us a hot take. Put it. Put it in A. Make it the biggest <laughs> difference between two teams. I can't put it in A. There's no way. <laughs> they don't deserve we'll, that. We'll give them a B. Just okay. out of sympathy for the seasons they've had. Yeah. I'm not making any friends in Pittsburgh right now, eh? <laughs> Throw this them is a our fourth team we put as a terrible tier. We're burning bridges everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> it is Same what it I- is. I can't not see the prison uniform on Detroit. Like, I keep looking at it. <laughs> it's just my like... first thought. I'm just, yeah. All right. On to Birds. the Philly Phoenix. Okay. I can already see what's going to happen. We're going to put them in B because this is a B tier jersey. And they're going to, like, come at us on Twitter and be like, bah, 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 that's an A tier jersey. And it's like, <laughs> it's good. It's a good jersey, but I think it's B. It's a solid, it's a solid, like, non-black, non-whatever, just like a, like a bright colored jersey. I do like the feather little pattern, feather looking. Yeah. Am I wrong for saying B? Am I too harsh? I don't no, know. No, I like B. I like B. I kind of like it. I, I like can see it in A. I'm not mad at it. I don't think it's a, like, like, I think the, the gradient blue fleur-de-lis royal is, like, cooler than it. 
I think yeah. like this is just a pretty jersey, but it doesn't do anything like extra special. Yeah, I, I I'm kind of like either mid or bottom B. That's where I'm at. Okay. I'm saying bottom B, like it's a nice color and I it's something they didn't go for last year. Mm-hmm. But I feel like you could just do more. Yeah. It just leaves a bit to be desired. Mm. Sam, mm-hmm. looking at it more, it might be like flames instead of feathers, also. I I can't tell. Yeah. Could be I think it's, it's, it's I think it's just like an abstract shape. That just looks like whatever it's, you want it to. It's kind of cool. Like I, I kind of like yeah. how they did that because it, it's better than just a solid red. Um, Definitely. Yeah, I agree. It's like there's just a little uh, something mm. they could use, but mm. it's good. It's not a bad jersey. I feel like from the back, it's super unclear what jersey it would be. Yeah. I don't know. Mm. I don't know if that's something Phillips. a lot of teams took into consideration, but I don't know. From the back, it's it's it's. Mm-hmm. Not super their colors, so it's pretty hard to tell. What do we think about the white? I, I think really you should have said hoppers on the front. Oh, Ooh, I'm, so with, you I'm so, cool. so with you there. That's the yeah, best I'm... handle in the league so far on like social media, and you got to just plug in more. But yeah, yeah, yeah I don't like the, the giant fella and then the bird it, and and the or the gold around like uh, everything about the white in the front. I'm not a fan. It's so close to being like A tier. Um, I think the font, like the letters, are too big. Um, yeah, I don't know. Like if it said Hot Birds and it was a little smaller and it was just done a little bit differently, I think I'm all there. I know. Yeah, I kind of like uh the different color ring at the bottom of it versus the collar and the. I like that. Fun, yeah. But I think yeah, if you take away the logo, too much white space. Yeah, the logo just smack there in the front looks a little clunky yeah, if it's at hopper at a number um, yeah nah, i think back logos are the way to go yeah all right what do we think look lookable based on that i'm kind of below lookable they could have done what the alley cats did and had it more like um uh what's the word opaque oh, like, that's that's yeah. not the right word yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. like blend it in a little more instead of just copy paste boom it's in the middle in the front you know Mm-hmm. and i'm now looking at it it's like you could have put like some flames at the bottom to like yeah. make a gradient with the yeah bottom. or something like it's got yeah. to be under lookable because like every time i look at this it's like oh mm-hmm. you could have added this or this and it would have been top tier yeah Yum. i don't want to look at it it's not lookable <laughs> <laughs> all right d top d or lower i think it's better, better yeah back, neck and next arc yeah. okay Cool. Uh, I'm with that. Here we go. Ooh. Minnesota. Got more stripes, but this is like a nice. cool, cool like jail uniform. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It's like I'm in jail, but I'm cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think these are like I don't know something about the Minnesota jerseys are just like a little more. I don't. I don't want to say iconic, but. It, they tight. have their thing. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's clean. I'm, I'm gonna say it. Like every time I see Minnesota, it's just like it is iconic, and it's something. No matter like if I'm just scrolling through AUDL, it's like oh no, Minnesota's playing. It's I don't know have a better word for iconic, but like to see it, I could envision Abe Cough and throwing a full field bomb in this. Yeah, I know. It's cool. Minnesota's cool. Like, we haven't we haven't seen any other ones that do different color sleeves yet either. I like it. Me too. Yeah, true. I'm into it. I'm into I'm, it. I'm almost. Uh, I mean, dare I say? Do we're, it. All, we're all, we're all say high it. on these. Say it. We say, say, say S. Are we say saying it. S? Oh. Oh, is this oh, the first boys. one? I well, think so. That's why I'm Brandon, hesitant. Ultimately, you get the final say. Mm-hmm. So, is it the first one? You tell us. <laughs> And we can always look at it again and change our mind, but yeah, we can change. We reserve the right to change. Personally, I think the whites are like just a step above. Like, mm. so oh, I mm. was gonna say I like the That's darks nice. more. Okay. I think I like the lights more. I really like I the trees I, at the bottom. The trees, the trees at the bottom are cool. so tight. Let's it's do it. so Damn. frosty. Mm. So whites wow. S. Do we go darks top of A or darks S? That's the question. 
I think uh, top of A is fair. I feel like yeah, they they haven't done like I feel like I need to be wild to put both of a team's jerseys in S. You know. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. These yeah, are these are real nice. Really... But yeah, those whites are really nice. I like the trees. Yeah, the trees are so pretty. I know there's a better word for iconic because they have been around the same amount of time as like most of these other teams. So it's like definitely not the right word, but it's like the sentiment is there. Like, it, I don't know, just something about it. Like, I always want to give them the benefit of the doubt if I see like them playing a game and I'm like, oh, Minnesota's good. Like, I just kind of think that, you know, mm-hmm. like I have, have that reputation. So, yeah, their jersey uh, are just like synops. Oh, geez. Miss... Now I forgot the word synonymous. Yeah, uh, there it is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's it. <laughs> we'll give it to you. Um, All right. Yeah, okay. Apparently, we're very high in Minnesota. Oh, Rascals. Wow. <laughs> the Rascals. See, I, like, I like that they did something different, and they went for a, a top right and only that quadrant of the jersey for their color, but I just don't think it looks that good. So – we talked about Minnesota being iconic. Like this jersey, like it's not it's not very appeasing to the eye. But Minnesota, or the Rascals have been to Championship Weekend a couple times in their past, and they've had jerseys very similar to like this. So I would say like this style, this color, this at you in your face is iconic for the Rascals. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's the only thing I'll give it. Other than that, I'm not the biggest fan of this. Yeah. Yeah, seeing it when they're at home, like the based on the fact they have like the second best home field advantage behind like Montreal, <laughs> it just works. So seeing KPS like laying out and doing amazing things in this specific jersey. Mm-hmm. Also, is this the first jersey that has its own sponsor? No, I, I think... noticed one. I noticed one earlier with a sponsor too. Minnesota had um, a sp- yeah. couple. Oh um, yeah, Minnesota did. But I I do think that the sponsorship next to a very small logo is a little tough for this one. I think mm-hmm. it makes it look like the logo is part of the sponsorship, or the sponsorship is like it just it, it draws attention to the sponsorship as opposed to the logo in the jersey. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I think this is a a solid B. I think yeah. they you know it's like it fits their whole vibe they you know hit a single with it or whatever and didn't exceed expectations but didn't like horribly fail either yeah yeah no i'm with that all right what where are we thinking i i'm I'm thinking like the third right there i like philadelphia more but i think you guys are higher on this jersey than i am i like philadelphia more too i'll put it there. i, like it too, yeah. I right. yeah okay I, I won't say anything i like this one better i think but this one's i i don't like this one really yeah i nice. I'd, I'd like this one less i think wow yeah. wait but andrew go andrew andrew cook a little I, I don't know i just think um a, a similar problem with um or the other the i don't know some of these jerseys like it's like the the darks and then the accent color is like also too dark um and i think that's kind of going on with their darks and i think this kind of fixes that a little bit and it looks a little more balanced color wise but um i don't know i think the darks draw away from the fact that the entire bottom half of the jersey is empty and yeah. this one is drawing my attention to that more mm mm-hmm. I mean, if you guys sort of do look, I mean, it's. I think it's above lookable. Bottom B. I don't even I know. Think it's I don't lookable. Wow. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I guess I'm higher lookable. on these than y'all are. That's cool. Though. I don't think it's D. I don't think it's D. No, I wow. like. You guys are low on these. I like lookable for this. I like Detroit's more than it, but I. I think I like it more than the Flyers. So. Yeah. Wow. Second flaw in lookable. I think Let's I'm with do that. It. Well, I would have on my personal one, I'd probably have it higher, but you know, this mm-hmm. is a this is a collective effort. And I I, I think the this. other one I think the other one like is more of I just feel like I get some 
I get why they did it with the dark. It like gets all their colors in there. And then with that one, it just feels like they had the dark and they tried to turn it into a light and it doesn't work as well. Mm. I don't know. Mm-hmm. All right, moving on, we've got Oakland. They've got a nice little stripe and a spider on it. That's kind of fun. I like the spider. And the different colored sleeves. I like this jersey. I like the font of the 23. Mm-hmm. I, I'll say it's not blowing my mind. Um, okay. It feels lookable to me. Hmm. Yeah, like the spider hanging down from the Oakland sign is like a nice little touch. Good font like on it. But it's like it's not anything terrible with the color. It's it's like a good standard jersey. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's just standard. I think yeah. Yeah. I think I would put it above the uh Rascals Dark. I feel like that's sort of where our good standard jersey region is on our tier list right now. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think it's tough to make a good jersey doing like a black into a gradient of just like another textured black also it's just hard to do i think the rest of it is pretty clean though Mm -hmm. and then we have the the white version of it which is pretty similar yeah again i mean i'm kind of um similar to the last one i kind of like the white a little bit better like to me they're like next to each other but a little bit better i don't know if y'all feel differently but i I think i'm with you this time i think i like this one a little bit more yeah it feels like more gray than white to me and it's it's kind of throwing me off yeah Mm -hmm. that is tough it is tough to bring a gray to a frisbee game but um i don't know it has the slots in it and then the bottom's white you know it's enough for me but um you know what do i know i'm not a professional (laughs) frisbee player not yet i'm but a mere mortal (laughs) maybe if i lived in detroit i don't know (laughs) <laughs> I wish that the, the sleeves were the same color as the stripe, but it doesn't look like it to me. Is it? Does it look like it to anybody else? I don't think the so. Sleeve. Uh, I think the stripe is just like a little bit see-through and it fades as you go down. Um, okay. Um, right. I'm happy with this. All right, back to the central. We've got Chicago. These are just... This, one's, this is hard to... The to... same determine because it yeah like it, it looks nice like it's a nice jersey but it's not new so like i don't want to reward it by being like oh it's great but like it is a, it's a nice jersey so like i don't know it's hard it's tough i think for me like when i said earlier i was like i don't know exactly what a frisbee jersey is but i know it when i see it i think that's this like i think <laughs> they do a really good job um i think the alley cats to an extent do it i think minnesota to do it i think these central jerseys in general like they really really nail like making it look like a frisbee jersey like kind of looks like a soccer jersey maybe but i don't know like i think they look really clean but yeah they didn't they didn't really like do anything adventurous per se but like um I, i'm really i'm really into it i like these jerseys a lot yeah i'm with you, i'm, you I'm a i'm a yeah, I'm high on these two. They're just it's so classic, it's so clean. It just looks good. Yeah. No. And if it's not broke, like why fix it? Like it's yeah. looks good yeah. for you. Yeah. Yeah, I get, yeah, for sure. Like if they went for something and it was worse, then we would be like, why did you do that? So, you know. Yeah. I'm um looking at, I'm looking at their old jerseys right now. It's straight up is exactly the same just a new color and they added the number to the front so i guess that is something new okay number uh, um just in front of alley cats i can live with that yeah i popped it right in the middle it's really That's clean good. yeah it's a good jersey no issues and then the the same thing yeah i mean it's the same i can't really yeah split them <laughs> up <laughs> which one's better <laughs> i like the dark better yeah, the home one got a bit of an edge. All right. But ain't nothing wrong with that one. Yeah, I like it. Okay. Where have we not gone yet? Let's go out west. How about Portland? With the charcoal and the orange and the little orange thing in the middle. 
It's fine. It's cool. I don't, I don't hate it. It's um, it's very similar to the Chicago one, I think, where it's like, yeah, I don't know. They got the name in the front. Like, I mean, nothing wrong with it. It looks really professional. Um, I would say bottom A, top B. Yeah, I think it I'm bottom A with like this. A, it reminds me of like a bicycle jersey. This is like a, for, yeah. for a cycling team. Kind of <laughs> does. They've got the Friction Glove sponsorship. Ooh. You know, Lee and Andrew Marks is rocking those. Oh, what definitely. <laughs> I don't yeah, think I think they so. do. I don't think personally. I don't think they do enough special to land them in A. But if you all think that, that's fine. I just wanted to make my point known. We could toss that's it fair. top of B. Top of B. Okay. I think that's fine. I think it's very fair. It's a good jersey. Right. B is. There's nothing wrong yeah. with being in B tier. No, B I'm jerseys are know. all good. This is uh, virtually the same thing. Yeah, it's kind of bland. Like for me, the white one's kind of like barely lookable. I don't think so. I like the um the orange backing of the number kind of pops out more on the white. I didn't even notice it on the gray. Yeah. Yeah. I think it could have used a bit more orange to like accentuate any other part of it. Like on the back, it's a good start, but yeah. I'm with you. Yeah, why didn't they do if if they did that with the numbers, um, the orange around the numbers, yeah. and why didn't they do it with the letters in the front? Yeah, that I would agree. have helped a little bit. That's honestly one of my favorite parts of the jersey. It maybe is my favorite part of the jersey. Yeah, I think they were going for like a like really basic like, you know, I, I see what they were going for, but mm-hmm. are we like bottom B, top of lookable? Like, what are we thinking? I just feel like we can't put the dark at the top of B and then they put have. the exact same jersey, just white and lookable. That doesn't make any sense. Something about it isn't the same, though, even though it's the same. I know. <laughs> I know. I know. I, I do think the dark looks better. Yeah. But I'm fine with I that, think, Sam. I don't think it looks an entire tier better. I'm fine with where you just put it. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll toss it near the bottom of B. Nothing wrong with being in B. Nothing wrong with B. We need more space in B, though. Okay. <laughs> um, let's get... I feel like we haven't done many East teams. Empire. This completely fixes what was wrong with them yeah. last year. <laughs> it does not look like a shirt inside of a shirt inside of a shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Agreed. Uh-huh. Um, yeah, do we have anything on this? I mean, this could be S for me, but, I mean, please stop me. I don't think it's adventurous enough to be an S. Like, Sounds like a breeze. Man. I think, I think <laughs> it's a, I think it's a good looking jersey. But like, I, I feel like I saw it last year, um, just like miniaturized on top of another jersey. But um, I don't know. I just feel like it, like it's nice. Like I have no issues with the Empire's jerseys or this one. But um, I think I going into this am only, I think I'm rewarding people who did something different and it looks good. So. You know, my my takes might be like arbitrarily a little bit lower than what other people think, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say yes. I think uh, it's a really nice looking jersey and it definitely fixes like mm-hmm. it wasn't even a gradient, it was like layered <laughs> last year. Yeah. Which when certain people bid it like looked weird, it's like, oh, is that an undershirt type then at the bottom? It was like, <laughs> awkward. What? It's it looks good though. I'll yeah. give him that. Oh yeah. This I think it's uh, an A. Yeah, this is an A for me. Top, um, I mean b- below Minnesota A. I have it above. <laughs> is that too high? I'm high on these. I like them. Brandon, what do you mm. think? I don't yeah. think they beat Minnesota just based on like if I'm seeing a jersey, it's like, oh yeah, it's it's Empire. But like Minnesota's like, whoa, Minnesota's playing with those nice mm. blue sleeves. Yeah. Yeah, I'm with that. Yeah. All right. Over to the whites, which are just the same as last year, pretty much. Kind of a Yankees vibe going on. I don't like the pinstripes on them, me personally. Mm. 
I don't hate the pinstripes. I don't like. Didn't they have like a darker trim on the sleeves last year? And now they went lighter. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think they had black trim. I liked how it looked a little bit better last year. These are still fine though. I wish that they did like a green jersey. I feel like that could have looked cool. Um, the outlaws used they're to they're have solid. green. The outlaws <laughs> used to have green, and let me tell you, like on a turf or grass field, it's just too much. It doesn't look no, good. That... Yeah, that totally makes sense. That's fair. <laughs> you can't you get to do more uh, snake in the grass type of plays, though. I guess <laughs> maybe that's uh, why they folded; they couldn't see each other. <laughs> <laughs> wow, throwing shade to the outlaws even after we are <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> kicking them while they're down. I'm Joe, so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, at least we could say we we're the only team that beat New York in a half the whole mm-hmm. season. <laughs> Amen. We'll take that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's we were that. we were aware. That's a legit accomplishment right there. Yeah. Um, All right. Somewhere in B from our conversation. Sure. I'm, I'm bottom A. I think it's A. I think it's still I, I, A. I like Indies Whites better than the New York. I was, a, I was literally about to say that. I think I like <laughs> Indies Whites better. I might mm. like Pittsburgh's Whites better, too. I don't know if I do. I like, I like New York's Whites better. I like New York's Whites better, too. Better than I will put them in the middle. Indy. Put them in the middle and of Indy and Pittsburgh. Br- Okay, I was gonna... yeah, Brandon. What do you think? I think it's not better than Indy, but it's you can make the argument it's better than Pittsburgh. Yeah. Oh, so right. we drop it. Does that mean we're dropping it? Oh no, no, no. I see what you mean. All right, all right. We're yeah, perfect. Yeah, we'll, all right, we'll drop good. it right in the middle. Right. I'm cool <laughs> with that. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. All right, let's get left? into. Oh, let's get into it. Let's talk about. We it. have like 18 or so. That's not too bad. Um, so let's get into the aviators, which is kind of cool until you notice that they have like a little man in the in the airplane. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even peep that the first time I saw it. Oh, oh, wait till we get either. to the whites. There's something oh when you zoom on in the whites. If the I, little man wasn't there, I think I would love them. But the little I man like just makes it so funny. <laughs> I think the little man is the only. It's just the. It's the best. Oh my god. The funniest thing I've ever seen. It's not just that it's a little man. It's that it's just their logo just plopped in there to look <laughs> like it's in there. But it's just yeah. their logo. It's like clip you guys, art. you you know Brandon Van Dusen had his hand in these jerseys for sure. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Oh I don't spe- speculate too much. What I will say is that um, I thought their jerseys last year were heat. At least they're darks for sure. I thought they were really cool. And this is like a step back in a lot of ways. Um mm-hmm. It's still fine. Is it is it below lookable though? I don't know. This is kind of an interesting. Is it lookable? I I would compare it to the Flyers jerseys, like the Flyers darks, and we're and if you had to like put them side by side, what are you thinking? To me, the Flyers darks look Flyers. more like a professional jersey. Then I think it's top D. I hate to I, do it to them like that. I it, I it love I love the little man. But if the little <laughs> man wasn't in there, th- this would be pretty ugly. I, I don't think it's worse than the Mechanic Starks. The Mechanic Starks to me are just bad. Mm. I feel like when I look at this specific jersey, it's like I've seen league teams that pull off better jerseys. So it's like <laughs> you you it's went like, for something, which I'll like give some credit yeah, for, but it just didn't sure. come off. Mm. Yeah. I this is a yeah. little bit too busy. A little too busy. Where are you yeah. thinking, Brandon? Uh, it could go top of D tier. I, right. I, yeah, yeah, D tier is fine. I mean, I almost want to put Philly above it, but th- that's nitpicking. But um, Nit- nitpick away. I'm cool with it. I think maybe yeah, I, I like, like Philly's it. a little bit better. I like it. I like I'm low. We could swap them on. I'm low on these. Philla, Philla. I'm low uh-huh. on these aviators. I do. I like. The way it says aviators at the bottom really big. I think Same. if there yeah, wasn't cool. so much going on, that might look cool. There's just like so much going on to the point where you have to look at it for so long to figure out what it is. Okay. Yeah, it's like what in God's name am I looking at? So do you guys know about the the hidden the hidden thing in the in the aviator whites? Is it the little man? No, it's the hustle symbol. <laughs> Zoom in to the back left shoulder, right up right in the middle. If we can zoom in. Yeah, let me. It won't be very, it'll be pretty blurry, but. Oh, it, God. You'll, 
Well, so, <laughs> in the studio. In the studio. <laughs> All right. What are we looking at? Right, oh, right in the middle. God, it's blurry. It's, okay, so let's let's not zoom in. But right on the left shoulder, do you see that gray? <laughs> oh yeah, God. I see it. <laughs> you see the gray in the middle? No, no, no. The 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 back shirt, left shoulder. The back oh. shirt. <laughs> Right there. <laughs> oh, I no, see no, it. No, no, no. Now Sam, I see it. Sam, how can you not see this? All right, stop. Right there. It's... <laughs> wow. Right, oh, see it. It. <laughs> All right. Well, it's very pixelated, but that is see damning. It, it's damning the hustle it. logo. It's whoever. Yeah. Oh, my God. Somebody posted it on Twitter and I saw it and I was like, that is the fun. It was like something like all you needed to do was like delete this in Photoshop. So we think this was like an actual like, this, oh. like error. It's not in this photo. It's it's in whatever f- the photo that you got it from, Sam. Oh, so, so it's, it's, it. it's on. It's whatever they announced it on like ADL's Twitter or something. Yeah, uh, that's where I got it. All right, let's see if it's good enough quality here. Do, 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 do. Man, they tweet a lot. Yeah, what are they doing? Oh. Who's that? Hey. Who's that? Oh. Oh. Oh, there. <laughs> oh, here we go. Um. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you can see it. Yep. There. Oh, oh, yeah. I just put it over the hustle jersey. I see. <laughs> that's, just a, <laughs> that's just a Photoshop Wait, oh. there. What about the bottom right of this jersey? What is that purple? That's the hustle jersey. Oh, they just oh, okay, yeah. They the just whole thing is the hustle jersey. Yeah, they just threw it over a hustle jersey. That's pretty <laughs> funny. That is funny. Daniel Cohen, if this was, I was you, not we got looking you. at the right place originally. <laughs> now I see it. It's closed. <laughs> All right. I see it too. Um anyway. F tier. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This yeah, is our first F. Yeah. Lock that in. All right. I think this one's ugly. Clear, but I think I respect it more for trying something new. Yeah, but it's it's bad. Yeah, Seattle. Oh God, can we that? Oh, it's Toronto tier or Pittsburgh tier? <laughs> or at least the whites. I don't know about the darks. Kind of like them. I kind of like them. Okay, but the whites, like Pittsburgh tier. <sighs> That is really bad. That yeah. is that is really bad. I'm not I'm not mad, but I like I don't know. I'm disappointed. I, think... <laughs> I don't hate the darks. I yeah. don't like the whites. It's, it's the whites yeah. that are Pittsburgh tier, I think. Yeah. My like, thing though, just just make it fully white and throw the oh, is it a Yeti Sasquatch? We also like have a huge thing against their logo. Like it's just not a good logo. Uh, you know, I, I, uh, I, it's not fair to put them in the same breath as like, oh, Madison's jersey. I, I think they they're they look good as much as the like Madison jerseys look good because like is, isn't that like there's that like iconic game between Seattle and Madison where they're like, um. I don't know, it was like from 2015, like championship weekend or something. Like there was like a really, really cool game that I remember watching. And Seattle was rock, they're rocking these whites and they look just like these. And I think Seattle just decided like we're keeping these because, you know, that's like, you know, it's like our old school logo. And, you know, it doesn't look amazing, but I, I'm not F. I, I'm or maybe maybe I'm like D on these. I don't know. And the darks to me are even lookable. The darks look professional. I- I think the darks are. I think they're lookable. Lookable. Yeah. Darks are lookable. My thing with lookable. with these Seattle jerseys is that like they made, like there's a default template, and then they made two choices on them, which is the half and half and the little circle of lightning bolts or whatever. Yeah. And I don't like either of those. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't. Fair. I don't. I don't love this logo either. It's kind of like a little mountain thing. Kind of stole that from 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 Denver. Except Denver came after that. <laughs> well, I, I don't see this logo very often, so I'm gonna give Denver credit. <laughs> Fair, Fair enough. 
<laughs> I see the I'll, other logo way more. I'll just say it. I don't think the darks are lookable, but if I'm outvoted, I think they I'll are. Be I Brandon, think they're better think? than. Hmm. I don't know. Like, I rather look at a Flyers jersey for way longer than just looking at a dark Seattle. So D would be ID. Okay. There like, we go. Brandon, I knew I, I knew I could count on you. Just like me and Ryan on the same Wi-Fi. Got that. Yes. <laughs> Damn. All right, and then are we F for these? That's fine. Yeah. 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 Okay. I can live with it. I can live with it. I st- I think the darks are lookable, but you know, agree, disagree. I'm with you. I'm with you. And I like, can go out, go out and buy a jersey and show, your, show your love. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Said, <laughs> how how nice this curve is looking right now. Yeah, it almost looks too nice. It's like a normal almost curve. too much like a normal curve. You know, <laughs> I don't really, I don't like that. Yeah, we should ski this bad boy. I like these hustle jerseys. Yeah, Same. I like them. I think I do too. There's now, something kind of like '90s about yeah. them. I don't know why, but I kind of like it. Color. I think for sure A, somewhere in there. Mm. Yeah, I would go A. I'm there with I would... you. Yeah, like with the purple, like the only team with purple in the league, and oh yeah, and they just, do it well. Yeah, they do it well. Yeah, nice royal color. I like that. Um, what do we think about this? Like relative to the Union jerseys, middle? I think <laughs> lower. I think lower than the Union, or yeah, maybe middle, maybe middle. I think they're better middle. than the Union Break whites. Up the union. We're yeah. breaking up the unions. <laughs> okay, not joking. <laughs> I, like I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> the Atlanta scabs. All right, let's <laughs> go to the whites, which have paint splattered on them. I also kind of like these ones. These are crazy. Like, who does that on a jersey? I like it. Like, I like it too. We went for it. Yeah. yeah. The perfect it's... level of experimentation and also keeping it basic at the top. And yeah, it it's works fun. amazingly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, yeah, I like it. The more we talk about it, am I, am I, are we going to S? No. Maybe. I don't know. No. I would Maybe. I would buy this jersey, like forget it, like being a fan, just like it looks good. I don't think it's above good. Empire Darks. It does look good. I Brandon, what do you think? Where do you think it lands? I mean, personally, I would rock a Royale over this. <laughs> so, right. right there. there. But there I'm a go. bit biased, so I don't know. <laughs> you no, are a bit biased. You're not biased. <laughs> no. All right. Let's stay in the South. Let's hop over to Austin, um, who went from – they did orange or whatever it is, red or orange last year, and now they're doing blue. And they've got just sort of a a white and a blue version of it. My My first thought is I like their old jerseys better, and I think the Union blue is way better than this. Okay. I think I think they're going for what the union were going for, and it's not quite as good. So, something about I don't know, but I, I like these actually. Like I think they look really professional. They look solid. They weren't. They're not trying to be like, you know, like rewrite the jerseys, you know, playbook or yeah. anything. But like I, I think these are like really solid. What do we think about this relative to Portland? Because they're kind of a similar. I was going to say this logo kind of looks like a tech company on the jersey. A little bit. I kind of seen vibes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like it's a deep? sponsorship. I, I think oh. I like the lights more. I think the like the name isn't super readable. Well, I don't know. I don't know which one I like more, but I do think the the name isn't very readable. I like the white more. The darks. I like the white more. Not the I kind of like the I like the dark more. Hmm. I don't know. Well, what I do we think about it relative to Portland since they're I think it's better. I think better, it's better in Portland. Better. Okay. I don't, I don't know. I don't think it's better than the Royal Light though. Should okay. we no, yeah, yeah, we don't, we don't do that. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I think Royal Light's better because it has a gradient, yeah. it makes it a little more interesting. That is the Royal Light. Yeah, for sure. I like that a little bit better. Okay, so how more. about like that? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Is that right? Okay. 
All right. B is filling up. We got to be more <laughs> harsh. Um, all right. Let's get some. Let's get. So I fielded questions on Instagram and almost all, or comments on Instagram. Almost all of them were about this jersey. So Ooh. why don't we? Why don't we get into it? This they is went polarizing. The they Boston really glory dark. They really they dove went. head first. They said, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Which I kind of respect. I kind of respect it, too. Um, I don't know, though. I don't know if they did. They pull it off is the question. And like, what in God's name does this have to do with anything about their team? I don't <laughs> <know>. <laughs> uh, it I looks don't know. like it looks like to me. Uh, a jersey that an eight or nine year old created <laughs> but it looks and cool. we're like just super super into it and then the glory we're just like yeah let's take it I it's think literally I'm... got like just the numbers and then a tiny patch and then the last name and then the numbers and then it doesn't the texture doesn't change it's the whole jersey sleeves back literally everything is just this thing i i think the their shitty logo <laughs> looks really out of place with this like kind of spacey weird like coachella vibes like design and then it's like they're like truck stop logo like it does not make any sense to me um i don't know but it, the detail like the the details are really cool like if you zoom in i mean the fidelity of, or the resolution isn't great but like the, the, you know the details are kind of crazy like mm. like the little loopy things say glory somewhere on it <laughs> i know that that's crazy know, they tweeted about that i'm mean, someone spent a shit ton of time on these what if uh, we just make an its own tier somewhere? Yeah, maybe between. I, I would at love D to and hear or... Brandon's <laughs> thoughts on this. What do you think? So personally, looking at it, it's like this is the definition of "fuck it, we ball." Like <laughs> every jersey for it, and I'm I'm the guest here, so I'm mm-hmm. gonna say that's double as like. <laughs> Let's go. Right. It's on tier. It's yeah, on you're gonna be that. like, damn, this was some fire. <laughs> Let's do oh, it. Yeah. Double S. It's not a it's not what a tier. What color level. do I choose? It's all the colors. <laughs> we gotta make some brash choice. I'll do White. hot pink. Oh nice. We gotta change Toronto then. Cannot call it the SS. I know, I know. <laughs> can't call it SS. <laughs> yeah, S plus. Call it, call it double S. Or call I it mean, S it's plus. like a Galaxy SS. Like, I don't know. What, what was the SS Starship Enterprise? Like, yeah, something like that. Something like that. All right. Um, so some of our commenters will be happy. Some will be angry. The giant it's all about that engagement. I love it. I it's love all about it. the clicks. It's all about our opinions are secondary to what gets more clicks. <laughs> all right. The the distinction between the darks and the whites is very funny to me. I'm it so confused. I, <laughs> I thought we were looking at a different team. <laughs> yeah. I mean we are. Uh these are I think, so I think, in. I, th- I think they're clean. I think they're uh, I think they're fine. I think they're clean. I do think they they're clean. It. I think they're barely lookable. I feel like they're also barely lookable. They don't look professional. Like this doesn't say like professional sports team to me. Mm-hmm. Seems like mm-hmm. a baseball type thing. Yeah, I was kind of thinking that too. There, there are shitty like fourteen U travel ball baseball teams that have jerseys that look better than this. That are going for what they're going for. I'm sorry. Is that too mean? That was really mean. No, it's fine. But... no I, I like it. Not applicable. <laughs> I'm being mean today. It doesn't feel nice. Like, I don't like that. But I don't love we these jerseys. Mean. Yeah. No one's listening to this anyway, so. <laughs> <laughs> they are a little plain. I feel like it's also a step down from last year when they had, like, I think it's like the New York, old New York Rangers where, it, like, spell out. Like, I think it yeah. was awesome. That was better, I was, like, yeah. a nice look. 
And those weren't even like amazing or mind blowing, but those were a little bit better than these. Like, yeah. and these took a step down from that. So for sure. All right. Yeah, we'll give we'll punish them for that. Um, let's do a fun one. Let's do the brand new Houston Havoc. Uh, oh, uh, they also went for it. I like these. Am I the only one? I feel like after all the talk with what their logo and name could have been and all the backlash they got, they did pretty well to like put something out where it's it's still kind of going to be polarizing, but it's not terrible. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It, okay, like to me, these are more lookable than those Boston jerseys we just looked at. Like this looks more like a professional sports yeah. team a lot of people were saying i don't like the colors of the logo that was a lot that was a big criticism i think they, they pull the colors off just fine with these like i think they they showed how like it works and i mm -hmm. i'm I, I buy it now like what does the white one look like yeah i'm curious to see the white mm -hmm. <laughs> oh very in what is going on with the shoulder I like that, whatever it is. I think I like the whites more. I don't I'm not mad at either of these. I like both of these. I, I like will say that I think the darks look like a third jersey. And they're gonna be wearing these all year as they're dark. I don't know. I just think they're like fine. I wouldn't want to put it on every other game, but I would like be super happy to put it on like yeah. every four or five games. I, I was thinking the darks are in D tier, but that's just me. No way. No, I like they're the lookable. I, think they're the look I think they're lookable. I think they're lookable. I think breaking into the league and choosing a bold like, color scheme like they did, because there's so many blue, so many reds, a bit of yellow. They had to like change it up. They did a good job, so it's at least got to be lookable. Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. we got to reward them for going yeah. for a totally different. Yeah, like that's a good point. It's like we're a new team. We're we can't do the red, white, blue thing. Like we got to be a different color. So, yeah, yeah. I, I think that's a great point. <laughs> I think then... I think I think that those are like B. I think they're better than Madison. Like look at Madison's jerseys. Like do we think they're better than those? Yeah, I think they're better I'm, than Portland. I think they're better than Portland. Also. They might be better than Oakland. Are they better than Oakland? Maybe in, in not, between not, Oakland. Yeah, I don't think Oakland's are that great. I don't think they are either. I think I have them like here. Or here. I'm cool with that. Yeah, I'm fine with either. Do we do we want to revisit Oakland? Like, are I was gonna say, do we drop Oak Oakland? Well, we're we're almost done. I figured we'd do some reshuffling okay. once we finish up. All right, that's cool. All that's right. cool. All right, why don't we power through since we're Let's we're close? It. Colorado. Fine. They look yeah. like the look cool. they, they they remind me a lot more of, of the Avalanche jerseys. Yeah. I I I so definitely lookable. I do yeah. like the giant Starbuds. Like fuck it. Like yeah. we're sponsored by a weed company. Like fuck yeah. <laughs> like that's <laughs> sick. I think I like last year's more for them though. With the yeah. 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 I agree yep. with you. I agree, I agree with you. It's like drawing too much attention away from like the red. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I yep. think these jerseys, like right now, I'm like, I don't know if I love the color choice, but I feel like in 10 years, I'll look back and be like, man, what did they, what happened to when they had the, like those colors, you know, like they, they <laughs> look like uh, retro jerseys kind of. Yeah, yeah, I see uh, that. Mm -hmm. I, but at I the moment, the white is a little bit better, but it's not better than Detroit's white. Also, it's so blue. <laughs> yeah, it's a blue white. Oh, are the, is the gradient flipped on the back? Yeah. Cool. Yes. Oh yeah, I think it is. That's kind of cool. I'm these jerseys are fine. Like, yeah, I think they're fine. I think they're lookable. I think they're new, and I think I like that. Uh, I like these better than Oakland. I'll say it. I like these better than uh, Philly's dark. I'll say it. I I, I, I want to revisit some of those when we reach here, but I, 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 I think I think Colorado is still unlookable. I don't like how blue it is. It's like not very much white for a white. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's true. Mm, true. Like if but you if you like, tuck that in, if you tuck that in, that's a blue shirt right there. <laughs> yeah, it's fair. Know. All right, what's next? Uh, next we got. Let's go to the shred who didn't do much. I don't think. 
what it looks I, nice. Every time I think of the black thread jersey, I just think of somebody like making a crazy layout, like a layout D. <laughs> it's kind of hype. Wait, Sam, you're supposed to be showing their actual jerseys, not their practice jerseys. <laughs> I think these. Wait, I don't get the joke. They just look like practice jerseys. I just think <laughs> they're ugly. I, I just think they don't do it. They just literally put the logo on top of a, on top of black, and they, it doesn't say anything. It does, there's no number anyway. It just looks like a practice jersey. I kind of like it's not it though. Ugly. It's not ugly. It just it just looks like a practice jersey to me. I see. I see. I think they're super simple, but like it works. Like other, like they don't need. I I don't know. Like. It's kind of their aesthetic to be like the most minimalist as possible. And I think it works for them. Um, I think there's other teams that have like big white spaces and that bothers me, but it doesn't bother me as much on these. Agreed. That's just me. Um, Brandon, where are you with it? Like, I can't get a handle on it because it's like you just slap on the logo and it's like, just call it a day. But it's also pretty nice. So... Mm -hmm. it's like between b and lookable for me yeah i think that's fair yeah. i i like their darks way better than their whites but i also think i just like black over white in colors yeah, for I me I like the white more it feels but, like I mean, they the same thing <laughs> yeah it's the exact same jersey <laughs> it's it's really honestly it's really similar to like toronto's or like um i think that's a good like comparison but like with Toronto, it's just like that to me is like they slap the logo and it's just kind of eh. But for some reason, there's like a difference with with the like they could have tried to put a gradient or they could have tried to put something. But like they're like, no, our jerseys are really clean. Like it feels more intentional. Uh -huh. And it, I, I know, they're pulling it off more for me. And I can't really say why, but I think I like the whites more just because everything are just those two colors that are their jersey or that are in their logo. Like mm -hmm. the Phillips is the blue from the bottom. That the number is the, I don't know the the, the half circle. This maybe a sun from the top. Oh, I see. I see what you're saying, Joe. Yeah, I think I like that because it's just clean. I don't know. I don't know. I All think right. I like the. They're the same. Not uh, yeah. Prison uniforms. Really, These are, like rugby. Rugby. Yeah, I'm definitely ones. giving rugby. Hundred percent. Kind of like. It, I think it looks nice. I'm, I think it looks nice. I think it looks good too. I'm not, I'm not crazy about them, but you know what makes these better than Detroit's? They're not in Detroit. They're not. They're not. I think I like Detroit's better. Like the side by like side, the, of the I like the, the same. Yeah, I'm. I'm fine with like tying those together. I also think I like Detroit's as the most lookable. Okay. But that's nitpicky, and we can get into that later. Uh, I like this darker stripe thing. What do you think, Brandon? I like the dark better than the white for the growlers. Yeah, mm. I feel, I'm okay with that. I think so, too. Do we think they're still lookable, or do we think they're better than Detroit? I, I like Detroit being the top of lookable. I feel like they okay. represent the brand of lookable. Yeah. <laughs> give Detroit a win for once. <laughs> <laughs> By putting them in the most mid tier. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Here's an exciting one. This is DCA. exciting. They really did a lot. Brandon, what, what are your Brandon? initial thoughts? I think it was when I saw it drop, I'm like, oh, they went for it here. And stars, the stripes. I feel like the top right shoulder is a bit much. Yeah. But I think it's like a really high a mm -hmm. Borderline I, I also think that this looks like a third jersey that i'd be super pumped to put on <clears throat> like two to three times a year i, I yeah, just a little too busy i think it's what the aviators wished their jersey looked like i think it's <laughs> pulling off that type of jersey a little bit better mm -hmm. um i'm not super crazy about it i don't know but it has i don't know it's just it, it is kind of a lot like it's a little busy but they're not bad and it no, may, I, maybe yeah. maybe even a step up from like what they were i don't know um what yeah. do we think about this 
compared to the hustle like also kind of out there jersey i think the, i think the hustles are way better i think the hustles is, yeah are better i don't know i think the minimalistic like top half of the hustle yeah makes it better because dc's is just all around a lot going on mm-hmm. yeah i think they're nice but I, okay. I just think they're if we pop it below they're pretty Sorry. cool. I mean, there's nothing wrong with them. I almost that's like the a little U- too high for me, but yeah, it's a little too high. Like maybe above Alley Cat's dark. Okay. I almost, like I don't know. I don't know, man. Maybe right, we, we'll come back to it. We'll come. I don't back know. To it. I'm very high on on their whites, so I would be okay with dropping these. To me, these are the most like I'm not sure how I feel about them. I think the whites are better. I like these a lot. I don't I love the font nice. though. Ooh, what's that? What's that mm-hmm. gradient thing in the background? That looks cool. I mean, that's on the. Uh, I think one. it's just stars and like a geometric this thing. Per- this would have been the perfect spot for like a, a cursive font. Yeah, that I feel had, that. Like that just says Washington, similar to like the Nats jerseys or something. I don't love the like mm. blocky font. That's oh what, shit, Joe! You that's got what one? it is. That's what it is. This was their uh, 10th anniversary jersey, and they got such a good response from the fans that they decided to make it uh, their jersey. That's so sick. Wow. I got this as like their 10th anniversary one because I thought it looked great, and now it's like just their jersey. So that's awesome. Fuck Can you yeah. model that for us real quick? Just so we got a better yeah, oh, oh, Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, take that garbage shirt off that you have currently on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pop well, it up. Joe, I'm not gonna do that on the stream. You gotta pay <laughs> for our our only fans. <laughs> yeah, we should just skip like Patreon or like any of that shit. We get only fans. That's tight. Okay, now that you're wearing it, I like it a little bit better. I just don't. For me, my hang up is the font. Everything yes. else, oh, yeah. You're missing last name issue. twelve though. Yeah, I got no name on it. They weren't doing names when I got it. Damn. Um, but I will rock it for the rest of the show now. Joe, if you could get one, I like it. One, one Breeze player's name on that jersey, who would it be? Who you shouting out? Well, it's got to be friend of the pod, Andrew Roy. There you go. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah! Ask All right, Brandon, name. where should I where should I put this? I'm really high up on it, but it seems like y'all ain't on that same. Well, this is you, man. I mean, you get the final say. Hmm. I don't think it's better than the Hustle White. Okay, I I, I agree. Either Hustle actually. So I also yeah. agree. I'm very right. I'm very high on jerseys who uh don't put a background around the writing on it. I think that always looks cool, except for whatever team had that little orange. I think that did Portland. look cool, but generally, I think like no background, no like black border around the writing i think it looks cool i think they did it well here all right we're on to our final team and it's not that great of one uh (laughs) dallas legion got a little gradient grade thing going on and then their big logo this looks like what they would make uh like bartenders and servers wear for a restaurant called legion (laughs) (laughs) Wow, that's mean. I was about to say I liked these, but that's a good take, Joe. I like it. Not the jerseys. I like the take. Sorry, I, I can't <laughs> unsee that now. Like, <laughs> he's lookable. I think they're definitely. It looks professional. I think at least. I don't know. Ryan's not high on them, but no, I'm I think in D. these are better. No, I I think it'd be a travesty to put Boston's like you know, crappy 13U, like Little League <laughs> baseball team jerseys above these that actually look like a professional team's jersey. That's just I my just, opinion. I disagree with the take that this looks like a professional team's jersey. Like, that that logo is so big in front center. Like, Joe's right. It just looks like, yeah. <laughs> like a restaurant. Like mm-hmm. That does bother me, Ryan. You're right. <laughs> I wish it was like a patch on the off-center and smaller. Oh, uh, you bring up a good point. I, I, like don't it. I don't know. What I do you think, Sam? Like it. I kind of like the simplicity of it. 
Uh, I definitely think it's lookable. I think it's better than like what Carolina tried to do personally. I agree. That's probably where I'd put it. I think it's lookable, maybe below Madison, above Carolina. Which Carolina? Bofa. Both. Bofa. Bofa. Bofa does. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Final jersey. Where's it going? God, it's so okay. similar to Oakland. Okay, so you just said, Andrew, oh, I think it's worse. You, you wish that the logo was patched. And now I'm like, I don't know. I don't, I don't think I like the patch. Yeah, I think it's worse like that. <laughs> I think so. The the line straight down. Yeah, why doesn't it go up to the top? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's just leaving a streak. Like, that one I feel I like is the. I feel I like wish they, they had put like a number. Be, I feel like it was going to just be too much white. So they're like, okay, we have a bit of a gradient, but like, there's still too much white. We need something else. So they're just like, mm-hmm. just keep right. on stripe. Yeah, that's a, that's exactly what happened. They made the darks first, and they were like, cool. And then they just clicked the button to make it white, and then they were like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's 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 exactly what happened. I will um, say just quickly, this is a good-looking tier list. Like, I have, I've got one team <laughs> gripe, and that's Oakland. I don't – I think they're, they're, like, they're there, but they shouldn't be there. Yeah, I think but that's I'll, a, I want, a I want to hear what you guys all think. I think there's jerseys in Lookable that are better than those Oakland jerseys. I agree. I like yeah. a hot take. Want to move both of them down to D? Ooh, both, both the Oakland ones. I don't know. Oh, I want to hear what you guys think. I I'm okay with keeping the white and Lookable, but Ryan, I'm gonna say it. I'm okay with like now that we've see where the rest of the field is at. Like um, the the Growlers jersey is just better than the Oakland Dark. Yeah. Fair. I would put like the white between mm-hmm. Colorado and move the dark to D. I'm I'm cool. I, I love that, Joe. That makes sense to me. I don't know. Brandon. I thoughts? still I like I'm the little dangly. Okay. I like the little dangly spider though. We were yeah, yeah the dangly that. spider shot those up high and then and yeah. then Yeah. Okay. Here here's what we'll do. I think um I think we're more likely to be mean to jerseys as we go through it again. So why don't we go bottom to top and start okay, dragging smart. things down? Smart. So Pittsburgh is in Pittsburgh already. Toronto's in Toronto already. <laughs> uh, where are we fine with F first? The Seattle and Aviators. Yeah. White. Can you move down the Mechanics. It, I'm, it with just, you, oh, I'm with this you, bro. This one. I'm with you there. Now it just doesn't mm. fit with the other DE teams. It do, it yeah. doesn't look good. It just... Yeah. Yeah. All right. Up to D, we've got Aviators Dark, Seattle Dark, Oakland Dark, Legion I White, think, Philly White. I think the Aviators Dark to, to F almost, but I mean, <laughs> if anything, but I'm okay with where it is too. Um, they're just not good. They need to start over, try again. <laughs> how many, yeah, how many points do they get for? For trying something because we did say <laughs> they get points for that. You can try something, but uh, <laughs> it's like shit. <laughs> I think I think the little logo puts it above F because it's the funniest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, I, it's I love the only reason they're hanging on to D. <laughs> All right, Seattle, Oakland, Legion, and then Philly. I think the Philly white is lookable. Oh, I was about to say I think Legion are better than them <laughs> but that's from afar i don't know I yeah i think it looks the better Legion tiny. more from up close so i don't know okay we can keep them both there we actually oh. switch boston and philly the more i look at Ooh. boston it's just like i'm with I that gonna, i was gonna when we got there i was like i think boston is not lookable boston's not lookable bro it doesn't look like a professional fucking jersey okay. i'm a i'm a I'm a Boston Jersey hater. I'll I'll go out, I'll go on the record and say that. That's fine. I can live with the consequences. Um, I'm cool with lookable. I think that's our most. I don't know. Team. I don't know if Carolina is that lookable. I I'm I think that's actually lookable. the one the one thing that's like I'm cool if they, we want to move those down. Ooh, they're so bland. They're so bland. Yeah. And, the only reason they look good is because the people in it are really fucking good at frisbee. <laughs> yeah, 
that's true like honestly like seeing eric taylor wearing one of those i'm like man it looks weird like seeing him in a <laughs> like, like he's doing so cool so many cool things with the disc but he doesn't look but, good. Uh, um I- i'll meet you in the middle I- i'll move their dark to d and then I- i'm i think their white is more lookable yeah okay we agreed that we like their white better right mm-hmm. yeah yeah definitely mm-hmm. Okay, anything else in Lookable? I think Lookable's solid. Yeah. They're, they're all pretty all lookable. lookable. All right. <laughs> yeah. All right, anything in B that should not be in B? Yeah, I'm um, going to say that y'all are higher on Pittsburgh's whites than I am. I'm okay, okay if we keep it there, but... I don't know. The, it, the one thing about Pittsburgh's white is that they got rid of their shitty logo. Yeah. Which I'm pretty high on. But I, hate I think it's logo. too high in this tier, though. I would agree. And yeah. It's super simple. I'm cool with that. That's cool. That's cool. Worse than San Diego's. Come on. I think I think Portland should be dropped in inside the tier still, also. Okay. I'm cool with that. I just think I just find it really boring. Awesome. Yeah. Uh, uh but look at their dark right yes. next to the souls, and that's just like logical, though. I think this is the same. Portland is is higher than New York, lower than Indy. But I just mm-hmm. I like I Indy. like Pitts. I I like Philly. I like Philly more than Portland. Darks. Oh man, we're, we're this is this is yeah. Mm. I think we can move Phillies up above New York at least. Wow, I think so. Oh, that's looking. Good. Anything more than that's pushing it. Yeah. yeah, y'all are a lot higher on Indies whites than I am. I was just gonna say, I think maybe Indy is too high. Yeah, yeah, That's I crazy. think we can drop that lower. What if above Havoc, below New York for Indy? I feel like Indy and New York are both going for like a baseball vibe, and I like Indy's yeah. vibe better. But that's just, I mean, mm. I think New York pulls it off better because I don't like Indy the the big Indy font. Like that's that's bothering mm. me a little bit. Yeah, I think okay. New York pulled it off better, but I don't like New York's because it's the same as last year, so they didn't do anything new. Um. Okay, is uh is San Diego too low? I I it... would put San Diego a little higher. I would give him a bump, him like here. I give him a bump. Mm, okay. I'm. <laughs> I'm not mad at Salt Lake's jerseys. I mean, I don't know. Are they better than Madison? I think Madison's got to go down. I think Madison's got to go down. I think Havoc might have to go down. I I was, like, arguing to keep Havoc higher than I think they should be. Uh Uh-huh. I can live with this. This is looking good to me. Yeah. That's looking Soul's an acquired taste, I will say. Yeah. it's, It's the one jersey that's, like, they're, they're not like all the other jerseys in beer are kind of fun a little bit and i feel like soul is like it's kind of bland compared they are kind to all of plain. these jerseys. didn't didn't we say that um portland was worse the portland darks were worse than new york but better than indy but then we moved around philly and so what are, are we still are we still thinking keep it where it is or are we thinking move it uh Personally, I- I'm I'm happy with how it looks, but um, I like if y'all feel differently, feel free. Hmm. I'm not crazy about the nitro, but it's just if we're gonna put the soul there, then I think having the nitro next to the soul just makes sense. But um, all right, that's fair. I, well, I don't do know. Do you think the Philly jersey is better than Soul? Because then we could just move it higher and then bump both of those down i don't think it is but if you think it is then by all means no no i was just saying if it is then it's like easier to maneuver right Mm -hmm. i i like to to me the soul are like really close to the union and i feel i like those i I like i I don't know that it's just my personal taste though like they look professional, they look clean. Like they they don't look too. I don't know. Like they it, they just look like a professional team's jersey. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. Moving on to A. I like it. I don't. I there's no gripes. Like off the bat, I feel like it's solid. Yeah, these are all good jerseys. 
I want to move the Royale White. I kind of want to also. I like them. To where? I think they're better than DC's White. Call me crazy. Ooh, I was going to say in between DC and Union, but I'm okay with that. I'm okay with above DC. I don't want to start any fights here. They, uh, they look I think I'm good. with you. Yeah? Brandon, what do you think? I think both jerseys are like right there. It's not too much in it, like in between them. Mm-hmm. I think we give the guest a tie break and put the Royal above. <laughs> okay. Sounds great. Yeah. Um, I think the the stylized font of the Royal is better than just sort of like the the Washington DC. It is whatever font they just found. You know? It is better than DC's font. Excuse they, I, they could have tried. I think DC could have tried a little better to find a font that looks a little bit better. That's just, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. Royal is a really cool font. Yeah, Royal. Sorry. Are we good with A? Good with me. Yeah. Yeah. My 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 gripe with S is there's only one. How much better is it than the rest of A? And is it I don't like I think it is. You think it is? I think it is. Look, I think it's I, I think it's my favorite jersey out mm-hmm. there. I'm an Empire S enjoyer personally. <laughs> Empire Dark. But oh, that's God. you know, you guys can disagree, but I think those those jerseys are tight. Um, I, I really like them. I like them, but not more like than the Minnesota dark. Okay, I would put it's Minnesota's dark and S too. I would put Minnesota dark and S too. We just have a Minnesota too. Let me just see oh, what shit. it what it looks like. What does that look like? No, they're too boring to be an S. They're not like they're very yeah. Clean. I like them a so lot, with but you, there Joe. is nothing going on. Okay, them above because if we're going to do that, might as well move the. Royale dark up to exactly. ask as well. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I think the the Royale could be an S. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Now you know what? For the sake of the video, let's do that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is looking nice. I think. I think we can we can we can put our foot down and make a statement, and we can say, if you put little trees on your jersey, you are S tier. If you don't have little yeah. trees. There's only so high you can go. Um, why, don't we do, why don't we do? Why don't we do S minus and have the other three teams there? Okay, I like that. S minus or no trees, no trees. <laughs> yeah, S S but no tree. <laughs> S no tree. <laughs> nice. Uh, we'll make it gray. <laughs> All yeah, right, that's good. That's good. Yeah, All right, I'll I'll, I'll make throw this in. Plea. I was gonna say I was gonna say, <laughs> I'll put one plea to put hustle in there, and that's mm-hmm. it. Okay. All right, I like this. I think breaking up A was really necessary. Yeah, I think this is great. I think this, this is, is great too. Very least. normal curvy. <laughs> I think we've yeah. done it again, guys. I think we've done it again. No, we got mm-hmm. bimodal going on. Well, it's really a normal curve because just the formatting. But yeah, the B got bumped to two lines. <laughs> Yeah. All right, well, there you have it. Boston Glory takes the top, Pittsburgh <laughs> takes the bottom, and then everywhere and everyone else is somewhere in the middle. Hell yeah. Oh. Amazing. Wow. Well, that was a long pod. Good work, everyone. <laughs> wow. Right. You know, stick it out. This is important because this is what the people wanted. And yeah. by the people, I mean Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you for people. Yeah, exactly. The man of the Brandon. people. Thanks for making us do this and thanks for coming on. Hey, love to be on. I've watched most of the episode, so it's nice oh, to be on the other part of it. Thank that's you. that's so cool to hear. That's we super cool. It's hard to tell that people are actually watching or listening to this shit, you know. Because <laughs> I'm I'd be liking on one account, then I go to the next account and I oh, like it. That's I'm a damn true, bro. True. That's a true okay. friend of the pod. Okay, respect. Oh yeah. We, well, yeah, uh, yeah. We'll, we'll have to have you on sometime for an actual interview yeah. where you get to tell us about yourself and we get to <laughs> hear you talk more. But <laughs> for sure, I got some interesting stories from the league, so might be oh, pretty yeah. interesting for you guys. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, honestly, like we we haven't um done a great job of like talking about the Canada teams just because we don't like 
know a bunch of people like from there you know um so but now we do so we're, i'm super yeah. stoked to like get more into that and learn yeah. more about what's going on up there Great. um we'll have to have you back on for sure yeah for sure like also we have quite a few fans up there so yeah y'all got some no more that like there's stuff going on like the huck and a podcast once that came in and people were like whoa people are talking about canadian alti everyone's been hopping on it so mm -hmm. yeah man fill in the gap Fuck yeah. yeah i'm 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 definitely here for it um yeah it's been cool man and we we um we love like sending people like t-shirts like if you want to like do a little warm-up action in a in a ringer the shirt we'll we'll definitely hook you up man um you know oh yeah i'm a model yeah. so i got you guys <laughs> hell yes there we go You're gonna put okay, us to shame must be done <laughs> yeah cool we got okay. anything else Honestly, I'm, thank you guys for making a podcast. Like, it's a bit, <laughs> it's like, there's, you got like uh, the swing pass, which is like very structured, but now it's like, you just got a bunch of like friends just chatting it up about all T, like P U L, W L now, A U D L. It's, it's just nice to see. So thank you guys for appreciate doing that. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, I appreciate you. that a lot. Man. Yeah. That is, uh, that's, the that's really nice, man. A guest has ever said to us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. thank you for existing <laughs> now we, we we definitely like we've seen you on twitter and interacting and stuff so it's been cool to actually meet you in person yeah, um because it's, it's always it just it's never the same like once we actually meet people in person it's like oh this is like i don't know you you see so much more of their personality you get to know them so much better than just like through twitter so it, it's been cool to meet you man and we really appreciate all the kind words it yeah. really makes it like worth doing yeah. Twitter on Twitter, I'm also a different person. I'm like a shit disturber, so yeah. <laughs> I have to see the legit me the more so. as you should be. That's what Twitter's all about. That's what it's for. <laughs> yeah. All right. But this was fucking great. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is fun. Oh yeah. Sure. Cool. Close it out. I'm open. Yeah, I'm, I'm open. I'm open. I'm hungry. I'm all hungry. right. I'm hungry. I'm open. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm open. <laughs>